Hello everyone, it's Adam here. Um, I'm here from uh, in Camp Thorpe in Goshen, Vermont, here for the Green Mountain Rally. Uh, I'm running it, so, well, with a lot of volunteers, obviously, but I'm the, the co-chair. Um, so tomorrow, by tomorrow night, there will be 300 people here. I'm first to arrive, and I've been meaning to actually shoot a video for a while, but uh, videos inside of tents are kind of rough, so I want to show you um, this... Uh, new Big Agnes. I paid full price for this. I think people think that I get all these sponsored deals. I don't. It's, no one watches these videos. But anyway, I want to show you this new uh, Big Agnes Goose Nest. Um, Heather and I, well, Heather loves air mattresses. I I just, I'm okay with this. This is my uh, insulated, uh, so it's, it, it's insulated as in it has, uh, it's the Air XL. Um, it's insulated as in it has um, a very thin reflective, refractive layer on the back side. It, it has an R value. I don't know what it is. Um, I had a green one of these that leaked, and this was the second cheapest they make. Uh, it is the wide and long model. So I have wide shoulders, big butt, and I'm 6'3". So it's the big model. It comes with um, in this little red baggie here. Yeah, I don't know what this thing is called. Anyway, but you can purchase from Big Agnes. Not, not a lot of people know this. You can purchase this bag that fits all of their mattresses. And so you can use this to fill it up. You fill this bag full of air. You just blow into a little bit so thin in line that you hold it like a, a bag of popcorn. And then you just squeeze all the air in. Four pumps and that thing is up. So buy one of these if you have one of those air mat air, Big Agnes' air mattresses. Um, this is sufficient. Heather loves big air mattresses and I've been looking at cots for a while um, just to sleep a little bit off the ground and get a little more insulation because it's already going to be like 50, 49 degrees tonight and it's only the first week of September. So if you want to camp until October, you've got to have some insulation up here in New England. Um, this just came out, the goose nest. It's interesting because you see here you've got these uh, this Velcro on the side. You've got Velcro and you have... Um, little clips what you can do and for some reason by the way i wasn't going to buy one of these just heather was when she added it to her card on rei.com it it went half off so we got two of these for the price of one so i said well add two to your card do you still have a discount she did so we bought two of these what happens if you own two of them is you can velcro them together and they form one basically um twin size bed if you so you basically velcro the two side by side and then you have Two people can sleep side by side. You can use a two-person uh, air mattress and a two-person um, sleeping bag. But we don't do that. So we can sleep separately. This thing folds up to be about the size of a a roll of tent poles. You know, 18 inches long. Or it's, the, it's the length of this. 18 inches long. And you can fold it up super tight. You will have to also carry with you... Um, this thing here, which I'll show off why in a second. And you'll also have to carry with you a um, a bag to blow it up. It, all, it comes with it, but it's also the same size as my green one. So it probably don't actually need to bring this, but this is the, uh, the blow up bag to blow the thing up. Um, it's a whole system. And what I mean by that is Big Agnes has kind of made their air mattresses, the goose nest and their sleeping bags all kind of work together. And I will show you why here in just a second. I forgot to mention too, on the bottom of this are more Velcros. And so uh, Big Agnes on their product page says you can put these two on two on top of each other. Or like I said earlier, the two side by side for folks that want to sleep butt to butt. Um, so now you have your air mattress and your goose nest. And it is, I've slept on this um, for three nights so far. Uh, so I got this a month ago. And um, the cot is definitely, it's way smaller than a traditional cot and it's well worth the extra size you're gonna need. And just, just so you know, this is, you know, I, I'm gonna have the R18 here. With my Big Agnes uh, Four Season Battle Mountain 2 tent, the um, sleeping bag, the sleeping pad, the goose nest, the pillow, and various other camping stuff like uh, tent poles, tent stakes, uh, little hammer, all that fits in the R18 top box. So this is not a big, you know, all the camping gear fits inside of here. 
Um, so everything fits in there, including, oh, also my Helinox chair fits in here too. So it, it is, a, you know, despite the fact that the goose nest seems huge, uh, it's not that big when you put it all together. And so what you're left with is this. If you're using the full Big Agnes system, you can slide your sleeping, sleeping bag over the red pad, then strap all that down. And so what it means is you're not going to be sliding all over the place. This adds some, if you're using a non-Big Agnes uh, sleeping bag, this adds some traction. But um, you've got this here. Let's put everything all together and I'll show you the final product. And now as you can see here, you have the bottom of this sleeping bag, which has a backing, goes underneath. And the sleeping bag, this is all sleeping bag here, wraps around the red thing. These are pulling tight on both sides. So you can see how that is hugging around there. And then up here, same thing. Now it doesn't fit beautifully for me because I have a wide and tall air mattress, but you get the point. It, it still fits. This is all basically Big Agnes stuff that is all basically seam together. You can't go anywhere. If you slide off, the mattress is going to flip over on top of you. <laughs> You're in it. Um, now, as for pillow, if I ran a, sm I love soft pillows that are like insulated, just really soft. And this is at the creepy bottom. This is from uh, Sea to Summit, I think. Who makes this thing? I think it's a Sea to Summit uh, pillow. D they're deluxe pillows, like seventy bucks. Um, this. If you had a smaller one, it would fit under right here. And then when you put your head down, it would be under your head. This is too big for that. What I usually do is I just put it up against the tent uh, on top of a backpack or a dry bag. And then I raise the pillow up to, you know, this level here, kind of back that way. And then when I put my head back, it all works out. Uh, but again, if you buy a big diagonal pillow, you can put it under here and that won't go anywhere either. So um, for the longest time, I've had a in, uh, insulated Big Agnes um, air pad plus a sleeping bag. Now I've added the goose nest and it's really, really comfortable. And um, on cold nights, you're really well insulated. You're getting the full R value. So you're getting the actual rating of the sleeping bag. I don't know if you guys know this, but sleeping bags, uh, the R value is actually a modern bags. Um, it's, it's based on having a pad under you. Uh, so if you're just laying on the pad on the ground, you're not getting the, the temperature rating that it says because most of these bags are actually pretty thin on the rear now for packability. All the, the insulation is up front. Uh, this, by the way, is the Anvil, the Anvil 15 degree. And 15 degree is the rating which you won't um, die at, uh, I think. Comfort, I think, is 30, 32. Um, I have a zero degree as well, but I'll uh, make a different video about that if I think about it next year. Anyway... Big Agnes Goose Nest. I'm not a professional camping reviewer, but I've used this a few times and I'm really loving it. As for why I'm using this on top of the mattress, I just want to show you guys a video of it and uh, I'll be sleeping elsewhere. <laughs> but um, pretty cool setup. You can get this thing at REI. I think it was listed for like 250 And again, we paid 125 a piece for these things or whatever 50% of MSRP is. I don't know what happened. I don't know if some bug in the system when you add it to your card, it gets to be 50% off. But this thing just came out, so it shouldn't have any discounts. And if Heather brings hers tonight, we can Velcro ours together and have a little goose nest for two. <laughs> All right, everyone. Thanks for watching, and uh, ride safe. Bye-bye.